Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. So, Uchaman Deka episode 23, the sky of despair. Agam's kind of lost his memory at the end of last episode. They had a fantastic fight, him and Deka, you know, Ashimi. Not Deka, Ashimi, you know, Canada. <laughs> Let's not make a mistake. Yeah. And he's saying he's, he doesn't know. He's thinking he's on his home planet. Uh, it's a bit weird. I'm, I'm, I don't know. Like, I, I really want to know if he's faking it or not. Like, I, I, I got to know. So, let's jump onto this episode and see what she's about. Let's go. Tashka. Yeah, he used to say that, you know, that they have the same one. Oh, yeah, he's talking about it now. I suspected that he would you know, be the first person to know. Damn, man, is he gonna be upset? Is it gonna create like issues and he'll be upset and everything? That would suck, man. I wish he doesn't. The words spoken by Agams after losing his memories. How would Kanata manage to communicate his desires to save Agams? See you next time on Ultraman Deco. The sky of despair. Let's go. Agamus is still in the memory of his memory. Oh, he actually forgot shit. I'm not sure if he's in the memory of his own. 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 This guy is playing his game quite good. What's the information about him? いたずらに刺激を与えれば症状が悪化する危険性もあると彼の方から何も尋ねてこないそうです我々に対し心を閉ざしているということですねこれはどうやって隠せるんですか隠せるんですか隠せるんですか隠せるんですか隠せるんです
The guy playing Adam deserves an Oscar. He's playing his character well. So well. Confused. Good. Villain. Memory loss. あ、そう、ここは <laughs> Bro, you tried to fool him and working. <laughs> yeah, the buildings are the same. Damn. It's like a time. As much as he's forgotten shit, he's still like, he was still a professor, so he's still very intelligent. He remembered everything. He was like, nah, man, what you guys are having as buildings is shit right now, compared to what I know of the future. This probably in the past. Mm -hmm. Mm. ソフィア。this is where you know that he's actually saying the truth right now because he never mentioned that there was a mother sphere in, in the past so it's quite good the way things are going right now man he's peeling the pain Is he going to reveal it? Probably suck when he remember she died, man. Damn. It would suck so badly, man. He didn't figure that out.
That don't make sense, bro. That don't make sense. You figure all that shit out that he's trying to save you. That's why you're opening up to him. And that's why he's having the thing on, on his face. It could be anything. It could be a sting from a mosquito. You know, anything. Someone might have shot him not because of you. It could be goddamn abscess or something that he's gotten on his face. And he's just trying to hide it. Like, he, you got all of that just from seeing that. Because I... Okay, I might be wrong again. I might be wrong, but I think when Asumi changed, I mean, when Kanata changed back from Deka into a human, he saw human, and human immediately saw Agam. So maybe that is why he said that. Oh, maybe you tried to save me at that point. That's why you 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 got hurt. So I'm thinking maybe it's that. So I don't say something to you off the rails. But but still, I like his face was on the ground. Except I don't know, man. I, maybe I have to watch the episode. I need to create another one. I just can't. My, I've heard of someone who said that. The only thing that people can hurt people is pain. That's not a mistake. I'm not going to hurt anyone. でも、だからって I mean, he's still polite at the very least, <laughs> like he was with Captain Mugaoshi. She died already, mate. You might not know that, but she's gone, mate. She's gone. Dead and gone. Dead and gone. Is he going to have his memories back? I've seen them. Is he going to trigger the thing on his face? Oh, did his memory come back? Oh, his memory is back. That's probably why he's running. Oh my God, man. Too bad for this dude, man. Oh, come. I thought there's one to put the song I was trying to sing earlier. Dead and gone. Well, go back and see no one. He will feel like shit. Because no one will be there waiting for him. I mean, he got back his memory, so he knows she's dead. So, it doesn't matter now. Mamoru. Mamoru ka. Nani ga mamoru da? Oh, what the hell? Sona koto, dare ni mo dekiwa shinai. 
Oh oh. Something is wrong. I have to go back. There was no subtitles. Let's go back a little bit. But he was talking about protection. Mamoru, Mamoru, can protect of a So I know that he said that even though the subtitles were in there, but I had to go back for a little bit. Mamoru. Mm. Mamoru, ka. Yeah. That's why you put them to the pass? Guys, I have to say, I don't know why for the longest time when I was watching the show, this never came to me. But the way he's looking at right now, just like the way he's looking at right now, he looks like the twins that played uh, Sweet Life of Zack and Cody or Sweet Life on Deck. The, the face is kind of similar. Look kind of similar, especially the blonde hair, the face structure. I had to say, man, they look really similar. Cole and Dylan Sprouse, I think that, that's their real names. Coach, you're saying that you Damn, bro. He's just bringing the shit from another dimension. The thing is more. It, it's not just down here. It's like more. He's definite. This guy's definitely gonna die. I, I don't see him surviving, honestly. Poor oh, man, man. The only reason I'm laughing and smiling is because I used to call the sphere, or I'm still calling the sphere nuts monsters. So his face made look like they left some some nuts fluid on him. <laughs> This guy's not letting it go, no matter what. He's not just letting it go. Hmm. Man, sucks for this man, man. He's definitely going to die. I mean, like, I, I don't see how Agams is going to survive this, honestly, in, in, in my honest opinion. I know um, Deka Asumi asks that, you know, Kanata's ancestor should, like, save Agams. But I don't see, like, the thing has always, seems like it's just going to go way worse from here. So, two theories now. Either he dies. Or he survives by doing some heroic shit. Or he dies by even doing some heroic shit. That, that option. He dies completely like, you know, he fucked up and he was still a villain. They save him, he survives. Or dies like someone who did some kind of heroic shit towards the end. I, I wish, honestly, I do wish that he kind of survives. I, 
I've been liking his character from when he became a villain. I've been enjoying it. And I kind of feel bad for him, to be honest. I, I wish he would, like, understand the errors of his ways and change everything. But I don't know at this point. Damn. Shut them nuts down, bruh. Yay. Two nuts gone. Damn. Ooh. Damn. They know who you are. That's what he's trying to tell you. Go fight us, Decker. I know who you are, damn it. Get the fuck out. That's what he's saying. <laughs> I actually like this uh, little soundtrack here. Ninja no nami adatte. Chikyo no me da mezo. Like in episode one, that was cool. Damn, what monster are they gonna bring now? These dudes. The fuck? Three for him alone? Dynamic, just go. Some of these scenes, man, I wonder how many times they had to shoot it. <laughs> Damn, man. Am I is getting ganged up on? The fuck is that? What's going on here? I just realized the tower thing. Is it something that is going to attract the, the mother thing? Getting messed up. Ooh. These guys are dealing with him really badly, you know? Bro, if you become a punching ball. Pick up back your shield, your sword. Move on, bro. He's struggling. Friendship power up time. Oh, he's pushing.
Revelation in mind. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ooh, he's gonna hold it. Ooh. Oh, let's go. Change them into salmon. Not bad. Ooh, okay. That, that was a nice shot there. Damn. Is this one of the first shot where we see a monster's body like split before the explosion? Usually you always see a boom and we don't see anything or we still see them alive. Is this the first one? I mean that we've watched. Oh that guy's fucked. Oh my god. Oh, King was there? Smiley, smiley. Come on, come on, Tita. Energy hand. Ooh, those are that's a hairy knot. Looks like a very old hairy knot. Mm -hmm. Oh damn. Smiley, smiley, I beg. I'm begging, please do not kill him. Please do not kill Chiga. Don't kill him off. Do not kill him off. To make Deka shine. Do not kill him off. I will be so pissed if that was the case. ウルトラディメンションガードについて勉強だ。今日は何のカードだ今日のカードはこれだ。マザーズ・シャフィア・ジャー。身長 the hell this is okay this is more like a a recap shit it's a recap shit so that's it for me i'll just cut it there i i enjoyed this episode man not as much as last episode i'm actually glad i saw <laughs> smiling smiling come into the frame but I, I don't think they're gonna kill him off. I just hope they're not gonna do something like that where they'll be like, oh, he disappeared into somewhere. I mean, they already did that. Like, he went into the Eternity Core for over like five years or something. So I'm not thinking they'll do that again. So it would not make sense. So there's no preview for episode 24, which I'll have to check at some point. But yeah, that's it for me, guys. Stay safe. See you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And tell me what you thought about the episode, anything that I missed, anything you want to add, that would be cool. Cheers.